Good morning, welcome to your best car in Kent. My name is Ben and this is the walk around video for our seven seater Land Rover Discovery Sport presented in Fuji White Solid Paint, which is a very popular colorway across all of the Land Rover products. Now under the bonnet, you've got the two liter TD4, so it's the diesel engine producing 180 brake horsepower. And you'll also be hitting around the mid 50s as a combined MPG. So you'll be getting very impressive economy figures as well. Now to contrast the exterior white, you do have rear privacy glass. So if we have a look at the side profile, you can see from the B pillar backwards, you have got a slight tint. You've then got black window surrounds, black side mirror caps. And then down here, we've got the upgraded 20 inch five split spoke alloys, also in gloss black. Now these alloys were a 1200, actually a 1300 pound additional extra from the factory. Now, also in the title you'll see is the SE Tech. That does give you a handful of the most desired specification. So for starters, we've got keyless entry. Right now, the key's in my pocket. The car is locked. The side mirrors do fold in automatically. But when we come up to the handle, open it, the side mirrors open up and we can open the car without having to press the button. Now for the seats, this is the same for all of the seats that stretch all the way to the back. You have got this half leather, half fabric combination. I do like this combination because you do get the comfort around your back, shoulders and arms with the leather, but in the winter months and the summer months, it doesn't get too hot, it doesn't get too cold as you have the fabric uh, right down the middle. Now these front two seats can also be heated. That can be found within the climate controls, which are just in the center console here. If we have a look up, we've got a fixed panoramic sunroof, but there is a sun blind as well. Again, when I show you the back, you'll be able to see just how far back that stretches, but it really does let in a lot of light. Then we've got a leather up steering wheel here for the driver, of course, you've got paddle shifters on here, cruise control with your uh, speed limiter, then you've got buttons for your multimedia, your voice control, and some other functions. Of course, you'll bring sensing wipers in their usual place. And then in the middle, our main infotainment system is our touchscreen display just here. So we've got satellite navigation, Bluetooth for your audio and hands-free, front and rear sensors, which you'll be able to see in the photos, and then your built-in Wi-Fi. Just below, like I said, you've got your climate control, but you've also got your terrain response control buttons as well. So you can actually select the suspension, the ride height, depending on the type of terrain you're driving on. So you do have a grass, a snow, and some other options on there. Of course, we do have our automatic uh, gear stick just in the middle here, a couple cup holders, and then just here where you would have the 12 volt socket, you've actually got an additional USB socket fitted in there. And then around the center console, some of the dashboard and the inner door panels, you have got this satin brushed aluminum trim, which really does break up the black very nicely. Now I'll show you the rear seats. So you've got a couple storage nets just on the back of the front two seats. Down below, we have got the original premium Land Rover floor mats. And we've got the exact same seat combination here the leather and fabric now as this is a seven seater you can adjust these seats you can slide them you can tilt them but you have got a button on the shoulder here on both sides to open them up and uh, enter the two seats in the back which i'll show you in just a second so now that we're at the back you'll see that the rear privacy glass does extend all the way to the rear pane and if we take a step back got this gloss black trim just on the bottom as well as a black bumper here now you may have noticed just here very conveniently you do get a floor mat which comes with the car as well so this will go on top of the boot lining so if i open this up oops if i can find <laughs> the button so of course when the rear two seats are folded flat you do have this additional protective mat on here as a Land Rover accessory. So it's completely up to you what you do with this, but it does come with the car as well. However, for the sake of it being a seven seater, I will show you it out of the way for now. But you can easily pull up these rear two seats. As you can see, I'm doing it one handed with one hand on the camera. And then you do have headrests on each side as well. So if we take a step back, you'll see that you do still have a little bit of space for some shopping. And then we can close it all by a push for a button again. 
So the most important question is how do you get into the back? So like I said, on both sides, on both shoulders, you do have a little lever just here. Again, very easy to do. I can do it all one-handed. It can tilt and then slide backwards. So if we take a step back, you can see you've got this entrance here and then you've got access to these rear seats in the back. You've got a couple cup holders each side and of course your seat belts are very easy to access. We can do the exact same thing. We can snap that back into place. Now all of the specification as well as the service history for this car will be in the description both on Autotrader and on our website which is yourbestcar.co.uk. If you're interested in buying the car you can give us a call on 01580 712115 or you can send us an email to sales at yourbestcar.co.uk along with the details of your part exchange if you have one. Now we're also accepting cryptocurrencies, so if you'd like to pay for your deposit, your part payment, or even the full payment using crypto, then again, please do get in contact with us and we can assist you a little bit further with that. For now though, thank you very much for watching.